Hey folks, welcome back to Grand Adventure. I'm your host, Mark Guido, and we're in Lava Hot Springs, Idaho, where we've discovered a great new campground, and we're going to go take a soak in their geothermal pool, so stick around. So Lava Hot Springs is a popular summer destination for folks from northern Utah as it's only about two hours north of Salt Lake City. There are a number of hot pools that are open late into the evening. There's also in the summertime a large Olympic pool complex, indoor pool and water slides. And you can even find some natural hot springs right on the banks of the Portneuf River. There are a number of restaurants, hotels, right in this very small town. We've actually stayed at a place called Lava Campground, which is a brand new campground opened by Annie and Cameron Salt on their ranch property, just east, about a half mile east of the hot pools. We couldn't ask for a better location. They've got thick, lush grass, nice greenery, nice trees. Uh, it's right across Fish Creek from their alfalfa fields. They've built a large uh, playground on site, complete with a swing set and volleyball court. Uh, the site pads are gravel. There is no dump here yet, so you have electric and water hookups only. Uh, but the sites have been generous. The shorter sites, like the one we have, number four, they've actually built an adjacent pad for you to park your tow vehicle on. So we've had plenty of room. Uh, the dogs have really appreciated the nice soft green grass while we've been here. Uh, the folks have been more than accommodating. You really feel like you're staying right on their back 40, which quite frankly is exactly what you're doing. Uh, thank you very much, Cameron and Annie. It's been a wonderful stay with you. Lava Campground borders the pristine Portneuf River for fishing access or just water play. Honestly, this pit toilet at Lava Campground has to be seen and smelled to be believed. And if you notice those vintage trailers in our campground overview, Annie and Cameron have lovingly retrofitted three such units on their property to rent out to guests.
One final note on Lava Campground, cell service is exceptional thanks to cell towers on the hill directly overlooking the campground. Only a half mile drive or walk from Lava Campground. Lava Hot Springs is a charming tourist town, population only 400. Still, it's full of hotels, RV parks, stores and restaurants to keep a traveler entertained. We can say from personal experience that the Chuck Wagon restaurant serves a very hearty breakfast and the Portneuf Grill and Lounge offers a cozy fine dining experience that's second to none. Summertime visitors can rent inner tubes and take a turbulent run down the Portneuf River right through the center of town. took advantage of our time in lava to get caught up on a couple of weeks worth of laundry and take in all of the town's scenic splendor. But of course, the reason you come to Lava Hot Springs is for the hot springs. So let's go check them out. Lava's hot spring pools are open year round and range in temperature from 102 to 112 degrees Fahrenheit. The pools are concrete walled, but most have a soft, sandy bottom. The mineral laden water bubbles up from deep underground, but contains no sulfur and therefore has no foul odor. Over 2.5 million gallons a day course through the hot springs and are diverted into the Portneuf River, keeping the springs ever-changing and clean. No chemicals are necessary. All-day adult emission costs six to eight dollars. Pools stay open as late as 11 p.m. and Patricia and I preferred to visit for a soak during the peaceful evening hours.
One more thing in the area we're seeing is the Soda Springs Geyser. A well drilling crew in 1937, attempting to build a natural hot springs pool, was surprised when it unintentionally released this captive geyser, which shot 100 feet into the air. It has now been capped and the timer activates it once every hour on the hour. We've really enjoyed our time here in Lava Hot Springs, but it's time to move on. So if you're not yet one of our grand adventurers, hit that subscribe button down there in the corner, the little red one, and ring that notification bell so you get instant notification of each new episode of Grand Adventure as it comes online on YouTube. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up down below. And as always, we'd love to receive your questions and comments in the feedback section also down below this video. And until next time, please remember, Life is nothing but a grand adventure. We'll see you soon.